Hi there, full of the interweb. Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Okachi Agnes. Welcome to my channel. Hi, how are you? I create content around natural entrepreneurship lifestyle and productivity. Kindly consider subscribing to the channel if you find those kinds of content valuable. If you take a look, take a look at my channel so you can see what I have for you, okay? And if you're into my channel, what do we over here? You are welcome back home. You are welcome in the name of the Lord. Amen. Okay, so guys. I shared with you guys earlier on that my hair was a hot mess. So I had struggled, I had been struggling with shedding, excessive shedding because I was so stressed from job hunting. Check out my job hunting playlist in the top right corner or my job hunting videos like, rather, top right corner. I'm um, looking for working in Lagos or something else. Um, I also told you guys that my hair broke off a lot because I went to two different salons and they told me that six and a half a dozen are two different things. They showed it to me that I'm um, more. Uh, you go to choke, okay? So I'm trying to like get my hair back. I already did a trip. I told you guys in this my video linked hair, my life update video that my hair was in shampoos and what caused my hair being in shampoos. All the juices on, on in that video. So go and watch that video after this video, okay? Open it another tab and watch that video, okay? So guys, I said to the guests, take my power back. Power must change hand, power must change hand, power must change hand, it must change hand. Taking my power back to share with you guys my updated, a round of applause, please, a round of applause. My updated, my updated natural hair wash day video for me to get my hair back. So if you are suffering from excessive shedding, breakage, I mean breakage that your hair will be crying, that you'll be crying like me, I cried, yeah. When my hair was, I was crying, I cried, okay. Please, I'd like to watch this wash day video till the end. Don't skip any part, don't just say, oh, she not just, don't do that over here, don't stop it, okay. So without further ado, you know how we do, let us get right into the video. Starting right off by making our own pre-poo. We're going to make an aloe vera slash revitalizing tea pre-poo. These are all my aloe vera leaves from my aloe vera plant. Okay, I've already chopped it all off and peeled off the sides. I'm going to go ahead and soak it in water to drain out all those um, creamy gunk that can cause allergies. I can't remember the name, but I'll have it on the screen, okay? So, just peeling off my aloe vera from the leaf using the spoon. And this is all the gel I got out of my aloe vera. Then I'm going to go ahead and make our own like mixing medium or our tea. I'm going to be going in with onions, ginger, garlic, and the DRS by Kachi revitalizing tea. This is a herbal <laughs> pre poo mix. Okay, my revitalizing tea, please shop my company, contains henna, moringa, black tea, green tea, and rosemary. Okay, so you know that you're getting the best of the best. So I'm putting everything inside one pot and then adding about 400 ml of water. I'm just going to go ahead and just boil it on. Um, low heat for about 10 minutes and you're good to go. I just got carried away. That's why. Okay, so I'm adding my tea back into the pot and then go ahead and boil. And after boiling, you know, just go ahead and sieve because you don't want to have onions on your scalp or onions in your hair. Our goal is to get the onion juice and ginger juice and the garlic juice out, not to have onions in our hair. So after sieving, go ahead and add our aloe vera gel in a blender and blend. Blend so you get like a very, very liquefied mixture without anything okay so go ahead and now see because you have to get rid of all the aloe vera aloe vera can like stay in your hair for a while it will not go the pulp of the aloe vera can stay in your hair and you don't want the pulp in your hair okay so now let's go ahead and pre pull let's go ahead and put my hair in 10 big sections so just going in with my cutting comb to section my hair to see my scalp my scalp was so flaky it was so flaky it was giving snowflakes it was giving snow white so i'm going to just go ahead and go in with the um, pre pool mix that we just made in our applicator bottle. You can shop applicator bottles from DIYs by Kachi, guys. This is the pre pool mixture. What I love to do is that if my hair has gone so long without being washed, I like going with like an aloe vera pre pool mix. But if it's like, oh, I've gone just a week or two without washing, I'll just go in with an oil. This is my scalp trigger elixir. Shop my company DIYs by Kachi. This is my scalp trigger elixir to pre pool. Okay, so the whole aim of pre pool is to get rid of any shed hairs, to get rid of any, to just have to detangle our hair before we go in and shampoo. And guys, if you don't prepare your hair, please try to prepare your hair. The the like is well, it was meant to be like a natural hair trend that would just come and go. But I'm telling you that I'm reaping the benefits now. That I'm going to try to get my hair back on track, guys. I can't wash my hair without preparing my hair. If I don't have the mental, mental capacity to, to, to prepare my hair, I won't wash my hair. I'll push my wash day by another day, another week. I don't care. Too. I'm in the mood to prepare my hair, guys. And the breakage, the shedding has reduced dramatically, guys. Oh my gosh, I was so shook when I saw my hair. I'm like, oh my. This thing has actually really reduced to from me losing almost like two handfuls legit of hair to losing like less than a a ball of hair. It's something else, okay? So you can go ahead and use a comb if you want to use a comb. Some people that like to finger detangle, go in with just finger detangle. If you want to go in with your detangling brush, your Denman brush, please do. But ensure you're working in section. Don't just, guys, wait for CD, CD hair loss. From pre you know. From pre you know. 
Just like I'm, I was so excited. Okay, so here is in ten sections, five per side, and they're going to go ahead and shampoo. Tell me, I ask you why I'm not subscribed. Tell me in the comments. Need a comment. Explain to me at least 50 words why you are not subscribed. Please, I really want. I just want to know what's going on to your mind. That oh, I watched video up to here. One minute, two minutes, three minutes. I don't. I don't want to just subscribe. Cause tell me in the comment section. Let me know. Let me know why. Convince me why you should not be subscribed. Tell me. Tell me. So it's shampoo time and we're going in with the DIYs by Kachi Cleansing and Rejuvenating Hair and Scalp Wash. You guys, if you don't have this scalp wash in your routine, what do you now have? Like, what do you now have? What do you really have? It contains amazing ingredients, surfactants. So don't just black soap and water and vibes, so please. Any other person shampoo can be that's not DIYs by Kachi, okay? Contains decal glucoside, it contains cocoa medio propyl betaine, contains your bestest herbs. I mean, it has neem, it has henna, black tea, green tea. Mention it, it has, and it's actually a protein based shampoo, okay? It has hydrolyzed oat protein, okay? So it actually strengthens your hair. So just apply it all over my scalp. I'm working still in those same 10 sections. I did not take it down. I didn't lose it neat because if you lose it, it's going to go ahead and then tangle. And when you then it tangles, you're back to having to detangle again. And why do you now prepare your hair? Why do you now spend hours or minutes detangling and preparing before shampooing? Exactly. You don't want to lose the benefits of what you did before you shampooed. Okay. So I'm just scrubbing my scalp, giving my scalp a good scrub because my scalp needed it guys i needed i needed it it was well needed i needed this in my in my life um <laughs> it was really needed i'm just going ahead to just walk it in this one was even losing when anyone that loosened you would just go ahead and twist it some people say oh, i'm shampooing my hair in section and it's loosening and if you lose it do it back <laughs> do it back now what was stopping from doing it back is anybody holding the air from, from holding it from not doing the air back you do it back Okay, so just rinsing it all, rinsing out all the gunk. And one thing I do is I can just shampoo my hair once, guys, because that shampoo is good enough to just shampoo your hair once. It's time for us to deep conditioner. I'm going with the DRS by Kachi Nourishing and Revitalizing Deep Conditioner. This is the one that contains protein. It's protein based. I'm just applying it all over my hair. My hair is already thoroughly detangled from the pre poo phase, but I'm just trying to get it to all the strands because my hair needs to be strengthened. Okay. Applying it all over, getting it on every strand, working it in section by section, still working in my 10 sections as earlier said and as earlier done during the pre poo phase. Please don't try to mise your deep conditioner. Me, let me lie. Because it's my product. I use a tub, a wash day. So for every wash day, I use one whole jar, 250 ml. Yeah, that's what I do. I don't try to mise or minimize or anything, okay? So when I'm done, you guys know the drill. I'm going to go ahead and put my hair in a bun and then wear my steam cap with my cling film underneath the steam cap before I now come and wash everything all off, okay? <music> So guys it's time for styling so i'm just going in with my softening and detangling leave-in conditioner rubbing it on my strands the, i told you guys that sex african threading is my hairstyle it is my hairstyle that is my style i don't see myself doing any other style in the next coming months okay so i'm going to do sexy african threading like an updo version okay so i'm going in with my baby wool. you guys know i use baby wool. i don't use thread because that's what i have and i prefer baby wool to thread i think it gives me a better hold 
Um, I would also say that you should check out the tutorial on um, how to do the styling at the top right corner. And you can check out my comprising video, Sexy African Threading versus Regular African, Traditional African Thread, you know, cute. So when I go to the end of this, I try to like con roll the, um, each, each thread, <laughs> I don't say each plus, each, each thread, okay, so I can put in like an up to sort of kind of vibe. Then towards the back, I just try to do all back and then went ahead to use a lot of wool to just wrap it like in traditional African thread, like a kiko sort of kind of vibe. After which I just roll it into a bun. So I have two bonds, sort of like two all backs. You can see that I'm just doing the pulling of the hair with the baby wool, okay? So that's it and that's all. guys i've had the style in for 11 days now 11 days today and this is what it looks like my ends are just tucked in up here there's no movement there's nothing it's so light with it. i've gotten so many compliments guys so i went to microsoft office like a couple of days back like five days ago or six days ago and while the one of the microsoft staff was speaking to us he was like oh why are you, your hair is so pretty and i'm like oh um. so this hair is very pretty it's very elegant it's very feminine it's very whatever it's meant to be and it's so lightweight it doesn't touch your shoulders doesn't doesn't i don't have to deal with my hair touching anything okay so that's very exciting for me i hope you guys enjoyed this watch the video get my photos on at, um, from diaries by kachi link at the top right corner shop my company the best in the business shop my company right now beyonce did not reach shop diaries by kachi shop shop my business i don't want to start crying shop my business please <laughs> follow me on tiktok and i'll try youtube instagram 131,000. yeah we did that god did Thirty-one thousand subscribers um oh my gosh i'm very excited about it i don't know why i'm so excited but i hope i hope i really hope you found this helpful i really hope you found this helpful guys because this is changing my hair this is changing my hair i told you guys that african threading is this sexy african threading is here to stay for me it is here this is the second time i'm doing it in the past month or two over like going on two months and it's holding on nicely, okay? I think I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to faith it till you make it. And remember that God is watching you. So give God an amazing show. Bye. Oh, 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 oh.